in this video, we're going to take a look at how to run a raw data report. So the first thing we're going to do is head down to Coach Tools and select Reporting. Over on the left hand side, you'll see our option to select our athletes and we can select by an individual athlete, by a group or by a calendar. So for this report, we're going to run a group and we're going to select all. Now we're going to scroll down and we're going to see the raw data report. It's important to note that this report is only available to the platinum subscription and higher. But we're going to select this raw data report and now we are going to see several options that we have. We can select from completed workouts, we can select from our sports science questions, and we can select from maxes and health. And these are three individual raw data reports that you can choose from. So for this example, we're going to select completed workouts and then we can select the date range that we want to do. So let's say we want to start from the beginning of July all the way to today. From here, we can select to show external IDs, any tags that we have on any of these exercises, as well as some advanced workout data. So we'll turn this one on so that way you can see what that looks like. And then from there, we're going to select download report. From there, you'll see that it downloaded right into a CSV. And just so you can see what some of the other reports look like, we'll run one for sports science, hit download, and then we'll run one for maxes and health. And from here on the maxes and health raw data, you have the option of selecting the exercise type. So you can choose to select exercises and health, or you can select exercises only or health only. You also have the option to toggle on and off whether or not you want to include workout generated maxes and PRs in this report. From there, we'll hit download report. And now we can take a look at our different reports. And these will all open in a CSV file. So here's our first report with the um, completed workouts. So as you can see, you have the ability to now um, adjust any of these columns how you wish. But over here on the left, you'll see the athlete's name. You'll see the exercises um, that they performed, completed, the date that they were assigned, the date that they were completed, along with the sets and reps. And then here you'll see the weights that they input. If you track power and speed through the calendar, then you will also be able to see that information here in this raw data report as well. If we switch over to our other reports. So this was our sports science report. So you can see all of the questions and the question abbreviations. Scroll across, we can see the results from that question uh, as they answered it. And then lastly, if we look at our exercise and health, or excuse me, our maxes and health report, we can see all of our athletes listed. We can see the exercise name, and then we can see their max value for that exercise. We can see whether or not it was manually entered. So if it was manually entered, it will show as true. If it was workout generated, it will show as false. And then scrolling all the way through from there. And that's how you're able to run a raw data report inside of Team Builder and have it downloaded directly to your computer. If you have any questions, please feel free to email us at support at teambuilder.com.